Hi. I'm going to challenge you to find some 3D shapes in your home or in your neighborhood. You just watched the video on regular basic shapes. Now I'm going to challenge you to find some 3D shapes. Let's first review what are 3D shapes and examples that your teachers have found around their homes and neighborhoods. So our first 3D shape is a cube. So remember, it looks like a square, but then it pops up and it's a, called a cube. So Miss Lena found a SpongeBob cube at her house. And then that middle picture are some die for playing a game. Maybe you have some of those at your house. And that last one is a game called a Rubik's Cube, where the goal is to try to get all the same color on each side of that cube. So maybe you have that game at home too you could take a picture of. Those are all examples of cubes. Our next one is a cylinder. And we have a bottle of lotion that is a cylinder, tall and skinny, a jar, a can of black beans is a cylinder shape. That third picture is a toilet paper tube, empty toilet paper tube. I bet you have some of those at your house. And Mrs. Fredo took a picture of a paper towel roll. That's an example of a cylinder at her house. The next 3D shape is a sphere. Remember, sometimes we call them balls, but when we talk about the shape of it, how round it is, it's called a sphere. So we have an apple as the example of a sphere, a soccer ball, an orange, and then this is a snow globe. The top of the snow globe is a sphere. Our next one is a cone. So we have three examples we found, two in our neighborhood and one in our house. The tree is shaped like a cone, tall and skinny. This traffic cone, this is a skinny one. Sometimes you see them a little bit fatter around it. Maybe some construction or if a sidewalk is cracked or broken, they'll put them out there to alert you to be careful. And then this is a box that was in my cabinet at home of ice cream cones. You're right. So maybe you have a box of those that you're in your pantry. All right. So you watched the first one of the basic shapes. Now I'm challenging you for 3D shapes. What shapes can you find around your house? Walk around and see, and I want you to share your pictures of basic shapes and 3D shapes with us. We would love to see them. If you have any questions, let us know. Thanks. Bye.